Hey guys, Pastors Brad and Misty here, Mountain Movers Church. Wanted to take a minute to give you an update on what's going to be happening here uh, on campus and or online over the next few weeks. Yes, so in response to COVID-19 and President Trump's request that we would help slow the spread in the next 15 days, Mountain Movers is not going to be meeting on campus for any activities, all right, between now and the end of March. So Sunday, March the 22nd, that's this Sunday, mm -hmm as well as Sunday the 29th, we will be online only, okay? And our midweek on the 25th is also going to be online if you're in an online life group, and otherwise your life group leaders are gonna reach out so that we can stay connected mm -hmm. even though we have to kind of be off campus, all right? And so this coming weekend, we're really excited actually. God is stretching us, and we have a great opportunity to really spread the hope of Jesus in a new and fresh way. Yeah. So what are we doing? So uh, we have an incredible staff. We have incredible volunteers and yes, leaders, and they've been working really hard all week this week to bring to you two exciting life-changing experiences online okay so one will be our regular 930 experience on Facebook live um, but it's gonna be better than before we're ramping up the audio and the video quality right. um, we're testing some things uh, we've been working on some some new upgrades to our technology and it's gonna be really I think it's gonna be a lot better yes. than what you're used to especially if you're part of our online family and you've been watching on Facebook live for a while so we'll have that at 930 but at the same time uh, let's say maybe you don't have Facebook live or you have friends or family that want to watch that don't have social media they can join us online on our website and we'll include that that link below but they can join us on that church online platform so that's really cool because you can interact all the same it's just right. not it, it's just it's just not the same as facebook live but it's really really cool yeah so okay. two different platforms two different also platforms. then at 11 a.m we've never done this never done it we are going this to so offer cool. a kids experience as well we realize that one experience for the whole family is just too diverse for all different ages so Mountain Rivers Kids is going to have a live experience. What you're experience. saying is, is if you try to watch the experience with your kids, you'll probably kill them. Yeah. Okay. We want you guys to all love each other <laughs> at the end of the day and love Jesus. So yeah. at 11 o'clock on Facebook Live and on our website on the mm -hmm. online church platform, your kids are going to be able to experience church for themselves on with their you, level. With the parents as a family. Yes. We would encourage that. Okay. Yeah. So you can sit with them, you can do the worship, and then afterwards, you guys will actually be able to discuss with them, and you'll be able to see how cool Kids Church really is because you're normally in the adult service. Yeah. So, so can I jump in? There'll, yeah. be, there'll be worship, there'll be an interactive experience, a Bible lesson, all that, all that stuff. Yes. It's going to be really, really cool, just like if you're in Kids Church, but like as a family. Yes, but a little bit shorter than mm -hmm. an adult service, okay? Yeah. So it's going to be an awesome Sunday morning. You're going to have the opportunity to share the link or share on Facebook. Mm -hmm. And we would also really encourage you guys to hit that watch party mm -hmm. on your phone when you're on Facebook. If you've mm -hmm. ever done it, you can hit watch party and you can invite other people to watch with you. Yeah. Can so, I jump in real quick? Sure. Just, I'm sorry. We tried this uh, earlier in the week. And so actually hit share first when you're watching the video on Facebook Live. Hit share and then it will lead you to a button that says watch party. Okay. And then when you hit that, what happens? Okay, so then you can see your friends are joining you, but it's a great opportunity, honestly. Sometimes there are those people that you've invited them to church and maybe they're honestly intimidated to come on campus. Yeah. So what a cool opportunity that God is forcing us right now to be stretched as the church, okay? The right. church, listen to me, listen to me. The church is not the building, it never has been. That's right. We are the church, the people, we are the church. And so we are to be the church seven days a week, 24 hours a day. And this gives us an opportunity easily to share with your friends, your neighbors, your loved ones, regardless right. of where they are around the world. So this weekend, get on at 9.30 right. and 11 with your family, share the experience, and let's share the hope of Jesus, even in a time right now that is very kind of chaotic the enemy families. the enemy thinks that he that this is an opportunity to like to pounce on believers down. and crush the kingdom of God ain't gonna happen. No. This is a time that is just gonna push the church right. to be more visible, to rise more above. vocal than right. ever before because this is 
forcing us into the digital world. I mean, not to say that we're behind the times or anything, but this is like all digital, all online. Right. So where we're not gathering in person physically, now we are online and we are we have the opportunity to hit that share button and Easily. send the so gospel easy. and the hope of Jesus Christ to all of our friends and family. So the yes. devil isn't going to win this thing, man. If anything, right. all he's done is he's caused the church and the message of hope to accelerate and I think that we're going to see more lives change than ever before, more mountains yes. move. As a church, we just need to continue more than ever to pray like crazy. Yeah. Pray that God would hold back the um, the disease that's spreading and that, that just speaking and praying health over homes and over Healing loved ones. over those Healing. that are affected. And, and more than ever, we need to give financially because there's people that are in need and the church is the channel by which God flows to that's touch right. hearts and change lives. And so we can't do that without your giving. That's so right. continue to do that like crazy crazy. Continue to stay connected yes. uh, on social media uh, as a lot of us are confined to, to homes and, and, to, and limited in where we can go. You know, stay connected as the body of Christ more than ever before. And um, we're going to get through this. It's going to be, w- right. when it's all said and done, God is going to be glorified, no doubt about it. So, That's right. Just realize that we are the hope of the world. That's right. The church is the hope of the world. And even in the darkest times, the light is going to shine. And so that's, let us be a part of the solution, not the Mm -hmm. problem. Think about the way that you're talking to your family, the way that you're speaking, speak faith, not fear. And Sunday morning, we're going to bring you an awesome message message on that very topic. So we'll see you. That's right. We'll see you Sunday morning online, 930 for adults, 11 for kids.